Now, a man has been shot dead by police after ploughing a car into a crowd of students and then stabbing them with a butcher's knife. It happened at Ohio State University. Police are now investigating an anti-American rant on social media minutes before the attack. Sky's Laura Bundock reports. This is the car deliberately crashed into a crowd of students. They were on campus back from the holiday weekend when it mounted the curb and careered into them. When students went to check on the driver, he pulled out a knife and began stabbing them. I thought it was an accident initially until the guy came out with a knife, honestly. Yeah, yeah. I wasn't processing all of it at once, really. <laughs> I heard it like uh, a car, you know when, when a car like breaks, there's a screeching sound. So suddenly a car appeared on the sidewalk and it just like hit everybody who was in front. So I guess I saw one guy like flipped over because of the impact. The attack prompted panic and the university sent a tweet to students to run, hide or fight. The rapid response of emergency services has been praised. Quickly on the scene, within just minutes, the attack was over and the suspect shot dead. He was 18-year-old student Abdul Razak Ali Artan. Originally from Somalia, he'd been in the US for some time. In the university's newspaper, he'd spoken about Islam, writing, if people look at me, a Muslim praying, I don't know what they're going to think, what's going to happen, he said. Ohio police are now investigating. Based upon common knowledge that this was done on purpose, to go over the curb and strike pedestrians and then get out and start striking them with a knife. That's, that, that was on purpose. The FBI is tracing down Abdul Artan's friends and family and looking through his social media to try and learn what was behind this terrifying attack. Laura Bundock, Sky News.